As we begin a new week, let's pray that it's not the same old, same old. It's not a week like last week or the week before that or last year. That This is a new time. And it's a time for us to use all the accumulated growth that we've had to live this week in joy. To really feel the joy of God and to stand on that confidence inside of us. St. Clement of Alexandria said this, All of life is a celebration for us. We are convinced, in fact, that God is always everywhere. Therefore, we sing at work, we pray, and we carry out all of life's other occupations. In John 15, verse 11, it says, I have spoken these things to you that my joy may be in you and your joy may be complete. God gives us the ultimate gift and that is this day. And God fills this day with new possibilities and God challenges us to use it to the greatest of his purposes. The Bible reminds us today, like every other day, it is a cause for celebration, not for dragging through, moaning and woeing. This day is presented to us clean and fresh, free of charge. But we must remember that this day is a non-renewable resource, that we're given this gift it can't be repeated. This is an opportunity. Once it's gone, it's gone forever. Our responsibility is to use this day in the service of God and according to God's will. So treasure the very seconds of this day that God has given you. And give God the glory as you go through this day with praise and with thanksgiving. And search for the hidden possibilities. They're there. Hidden possibilities that God has placed along your path. Today is a precious, wonderful gift from God. Use it joyfully. And encourage others to do the same. After all, as it says in Psalms, this is the day the Lord has made. Rejoice and be glad in it. Well, today we pray that this is a time of rejoicing. It is a time of discovering the newness of life. A time of discovering a day that has never been lived before. Help us to see, God, the hidden opportunities and the hidden jewels behind the surface of our eyes. Thank you, God. In Jesus Christ's name we pray. Amen.